What's up today, my fellow man soldiers? So what we're going to be going over right now is all the free stuff that we're going to be able to get through this new most feared program. And for those who do like spending money, we'll check out a few of the store offers just to see which is the best one for those who actually do want to buy a pack. Maybe I'll show you guys some recommendations and so forth. But for me personally, I'm not going to buy anything. I'm just going to get everything that EA gives me for free. And that's about it. And that's the honest truth. So let's go ahead and get it started. So I logged in right now, um, just right now. So this is what they're giving me. So we'll go ahead and open it right here and see um, what we got to pick from or what it is, whatever it is. That's actually a nice little animation right there. Tyson Hill or upgrade token. Whoa, 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 what? Tyson Hill, okay, 81 overall Tyson Hill or fantasy pack. Walk up, what? Upgrade token for what? Oh, play. <clears throat> oh, most fear player MLB. Middle linebacker. Hmm. Most feared Tyson Hill tight end. Most feared cornerback. Most feared defensive. Oh, so these are like, so you got Tyson Hill as well. When you get the pick, I thought we got to pick Tyson Hill as well as these other ones. Most feared Tyson Hill receiver. I wanted the receiver because they get all 32 team cams. Cornerback. Um. Oh man, I, might, I, I do. I could use a quarterback. I don't know what I'm gonna pick yet, so I'm gonna leave that there. But at least we know what it is. I'm not picking under that. So let's see what this is right here. This is a sinister selection ticket pack. Okay, what is this? Uh, I'm assuming this maybe for a head-to-head -head or something event. All right. So we got that out the way. Let's check out the challenges first, and then we'll go ahead and check out everything else. So we got two most fierce set of challenges. So I didn't have the rewards. It just has challenges. Where's the rewards at? They don't even, what? So this is just coins. So it must be in the fill pass. Yeah, cause they're just giving us coins right here. So this, this must just be for, yeah. Cause there's usually some type of rewards on top and I don't see that same thing with this. What does it mean view? I'm gonna have to check that out right now. It said view in the beginning, so I'm gonna go back out and check. Nope. All right, so let's back out. It says view. Oh. Okay, so there is, okay, here we go here. That, oh, okay, wow. Apparently that's new, the milestones, right? Because we never had to do that, so that this is new right here. So here we go here. 500 fear, so that's the currency. 82 overall, most fear fantasy pack, 82 plus. I'm going with 82 plus. Tyson Hill, our upgrade token. What? Tyson Hill, up? yeah. So it's the 82 or 84 plus and 500 fear. So that's what we're getting for that. So let me go back to this because apparently I'm going to see it there. So same thing. Fear, okay. So we're getting that from the from, from the solos. Let's go to the fill pass, most feared. Let's check out the rewards first. All right, here we go. So yeah, it's, it's a new look. They have a whole new look. It's usually it looks like a whole new Madden. To be honest with you, it's kind of weird how they did that. Anyways, 500 feared. I guess they call it feared. Uh, whatever they want to call that. Most feared fantasy pack. Don't know what's in there. Oh, here we go. Is it 82 or 82 plus? 700 fear. Okay. 750 most feared upgrade token. 750. Most fear spooky pack. I don't know what that is. It just says most fear spooky pack. Thousand fear 85 overall BND Divine Diablo. Upgradable player. So he's upgradable. Most fear upgrade token. Most fear spooky pack. A thousand fear. I want to see something. Something. So that's it. Just the players they gave us in that. All right. So we got to get stars right there. These are sets. Complete one most fear set. We're going to get an 80. Okay. Upgrade token. So I will be completing some sets. Not a problem. And then these are just the objectives. So make sure you guys have two most fear players in your lineup. Because if you don't, these objectives are not going to track. So if anything I say today, make sure you have two most fear players in your lineup. Get the, get the free ones they give you. You should be able to get up to two free from the beginning. If not, buy some low overall versions or complete a set. Low overall set. Add them to your lineup. And start getting these com uh, objectives completed. 
All right, solo battles, take a win. So what are these? 85 overall Kenneth Walker, upgradable player. 85 overall BND Grady Jarrett, upgradable player. So we have, win five solo battles, get a 85 overall, win another. Okay, these are upgradable players. Okay, I don't know how exactly this is gonna go about, but apparently, oh, you get 1,400 most, what is this? Record 50, 50, 50 rushing yards with the most feared player in your lineup. 50 rushing yards, that's it? And you're gonna get 1,400. Oh, that's actually not bad. The rewards look all right. We'll see how they come to fruition as we're grinding. All right, so we get an 84 overall BND player to start off with. So this could be your free, the, this is one of the players you could just add to your lineup to, to count towards the two most feared players. Okay, that's cool because my my cornerback is only 82. Oh no, I think he's well not. I have my third one is. I think he's 85 now, so I can actually use that. There's an opportunity pack. Ah, I'm cool with that's not cool. What about this one? 282 plus. Uh, I mean, it's not bad. I mean, it's just it's just 250 right if you want to do that, but uh, I definitely won't get that. What about this 150 pack? Contains one times 87 overall most fear pack. This right here, I will tell you guys, 87 overall for 150. If you have it, it's only BND, but it is worth the 150 if you do want to get it. If you have it on your account, or if I have a little bit of change, I just want to get rid of. This is not bad. Whatever else after that, I don't know what that is, but um, definitely won't be getting none of the rest of the stuff. But 150 is not bad if you do want to get that. All right, so here's the fear store. So with the fear points, okay, so you can get these other players. I'm gonna save a oh the upgrade tokens though that's gonna be kind of hard. Do we have upgradable with with fear? Okay, so where's the ninety? So this is the night. Okay, so this is the BND ninety, and this is the auctionable one. I'm gonna see how much fear fear currency I can get, but definitely I would definitely love to get a ninety overall. That's what I'll be working towards. Here's some packs and everything else select offers we're not worrying about that okay here now here's the season tickets so these are not it's not bad so I, I could basically upgrade one all the way up into an 89 right now if i wanted to the 90 overall is a thousand i won't worry about the 90 overall but i could upgrade one of my players up to an 89 right now if i wanted to with the, with the season tickets i have so it's not too bad and it goes all the way up to a 90 so it's pretty cool and then you also got more packs if you want to buy them with your tickets if you guys want to go ahead and do that all right all because i bought i bought the pack oh yeah i bought that one coin pack all right so now let's go ahead and check out the the players let's go most feared all right twenty thousand for 82 overall what 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 the heck or is this something i don't know about yeah, that is kind of ridiculous. All right, so let's see how much the 90s are going for then. 416, not bad, not bad. The 90 overalls, and just a couple days ago, the 88s were going for that bomb, about that, about that much, 88s and 89s. So not, not too bad, not too bad. And oh, we have to see the set, because there's a set where we're going to get all our 90s back, right? All right, so let's go to 80. There is no 88s, it's only 87s, right? <clears throat> All right, so 87, 137. Yeah, I only think, see the the, the 87s are they're, they're not that long ago. They're they're very cheap, but I think they're more because of the sets and because people are probably trying to complete them. So yeah, I'm cool with that. But I'm gonna go to the sets now because there is a set to where if you put like 2090s, you get all of them all back. Where is it at? Is this it? Most fear champions. Say. Oh, they changed it to. That's what I thought. I only seen ten that last time. Okay, so that's not too, future release most fear player. Oh, so we gotta wait for another player. So anyway, it said exchange ten ninety overall most fear champion players and future most fear champion players to receive three times most fear upgrade tokens. So you're gonna get three most fear upgrade tokens and all most fear champions return. Hold on, what? Wait a what? Why did I think that this was a good idea? Yeah, I don't know why I thought the. I'm used to have, doing it for a champion, right? For most champion players and future most of your players to receive three. So you're only doing this for upgrade tokens? 
I was really thinking they don't say B and D though, so they're probably they, I'm assuming they might be auctionable. I really don't know when it comes to yeah, because before when you complete a champion set, you'll get a master back, and then you'll sell the master and keep the B and Ds. But, but what is looking like right, right here, you'll get your players back. I'm assuming auctionable because they don't say B and D. Getting them back is B and D, but you're gonna get uh, upgrade tokens. Ah, uh, that that's not even worth my time. I'm gonna be honest with you. I might even wanna do that. All right, so these, these are the sets, but yeah, that's not nothing uh, really too crazy. But let's go ahead and check out the head to head and stuff. <clears throat> All right, fill pass. So head to head, see what we got going on in the events. Champion, so there's nothing going on head to head. So I'm assuming that maybe house, house rules. Mm, nope, there ain't nothing going on in house rules. So I, I, so apparently the event has to do with you just have to win games and then you get uh solo seasons. You have to win games. Okay, yeah. So there's nothing going on. So you win the games and then you're gonna get those players. So that's what they're offering you guys. Nothing in about solo battles. Unless there's something that I I didn't see, but apparently you just got to win the games and you're gonna get certain players. If you win like five games or whatever the case may be, because it's not really uh, showing no most fear or anything right here. So that's all it is. If you win five games, you're going to get those players that I was telling you guys about. Is it right here? Where is it at? Yeah. So if you win five solo season games, you're going to get a player. Win five solo battle games, you're going to get a player. And then these other ones are going to get different things. So whatever mode that you're going to play. Okay, so that's really what it is. I don't know if you're going to be able to upgrade every single one for free. Apparently, he is trying to make it seem to where you might be able to upgrade one or two. But the other ones, you're going to have to do a lot of stuff in order to upgrade those players. But there is a lot to do. So that's what I figured I'll go through right now. So anyways, until next time. I